In this video, we're going to have a look at how to find and report on our canvassing activity that happened in Field Edge. And we're going to use Nation Builder to find that information and uh, generate a report and view any notes that uh, have been made while canvassing. And the way that we're going to do this is using Nation Builder's filtering tools. And the reason we really do this is that Field Edge is, of course, built exclusively for Nation Builder. And our canvassing workflows tie directly into Nation Builder's logged contact feature. And so, what this does is uh, when you canvass a person, when you complete them, uh, as part of that process, generally what you're doing is uh, defining the outcome of that interaction, whether it was answered, had a meaningful interaction, and uh, you, you often make notes and set a support level as well. And so when that happens, that information gets synced back up to your nation as logged contact. And so what it will tell Nation Builder is that this person was contacted via a door knock uh, at this date and time, and here was the outcome, and here were any notes that were associated with it. So I'm here in uh, my Sandbox Nation, and what I'm gonna do is a run a filter here. So I'm gonna click on the filter icon, and I'm gonna start adding some criteria here. So I'm gonna start with uh, contact. And I'm going to uh, select contacted. Uh, and this is going to uh, give us two options. Has been contacted, has not been contacted. Now, I'm also going to add uh, some more here. So uh, I'm searching for contact to get all the different options here. And I'm going to select contact method. And that contact method uh, I'm going to set to door knock. All right. So at this point, um, I can run this filter, and uh, this one is this first one is a little bit redundant, so you don't necessarily need that one. But we can see everyone in our nation that has been contacted um, via door knock, right? And you can see that these uh, field edge tags are present on all of these people here, right? And that tells. Uh, th that helps the, the field edge to uh, track uh, who has and hasn't been canvassed. Now, if we want to get a little bit more specific uh, about uh, who has been uh, contacted when uh, and things like that, we can add more criteria. So I can come back, I can type contact. I'll try and type contact. I can type contact here to get a list of the different uh, contact filtering options here. And um, I am going to add um, contact, contacted by. So for example, if I wanted to filter by a specific control panel user, a specific canvasser, I can do that. All right, so I can go in here and I can select a particular person as having contact. And then I can filter and that's gonna show me everyone who uh, was contacted uh, via door knock uh, by James Hart, all right? I'm gonna delete that one for now, and I'm gonna come back in. I'm gonna show you um, one more. Uh, well, I might show you two more um, options that might be helpful. Contacted on date, right? So if we want to uh, find someone who, or find everyone who was uh, canvassed yesterday, and it's the 10th today, so I'm gonna select the 9th here, I can find everyone who was contacted yesterday via door knock. Now, I've also got some other really helpful options here. So I've got uh, is, is not, before, is before or on, um, after, etc. right? So uh, if I want to um, uh, do a period of time, I can say is between. So I can come in here and I can say is between this date and uh, a previous date here. And uh, that can give me everyone that was uh, door knocked during that time. Now one more that I will show you here uh, is the uh, status. So this is the status that your canvassers select while they're canvassing. 
So we've got answered, bad info, uh, meaningful interaction, no answer, etc. So if we wanted to just drill down on uh, no answers, uh, because we want to, or um, inaccessible, um, those are probably the two for this example, uh, depending on how you've chosen to, to define these. And so we want to create a list of new people uh, that we want to re-canvas because we haven't been able to reach them uh, previously, right? So I could come in here, I'd actually probably delete this one. I would say contact method is, and uh, I want it just this period where we've been canvassing for the last period of time. Um, and I want everyone who we won't be able to reach, right? And so I can create a new list and, and re-canvas those people. All right, so I'm gonna filter on that and that would then def refine our list down here, okay? So um, let me just, I'm just gonna delete these quickly and I just wanna show you uh, what it looks like on the person's profile once you actually go in and have a look at what that looks like. So we've got Steve Jobs here and I'm gonna go to the activity feed and uh, wow, this one was a while ago. I can see that uh, this person, uh, Anderson, uh, which I guess is, is me, uh, contacted Steve Jobs via door knock. Uh, they had a meaningful interaction and uh, I can see we've got a note here. Now this note is not very helpful, uh, but there's a note there nonetheless. Now I'm gonna go back and just have a look at one more. Um, but they're gonna look very similar. So if I go to John uh, Citizenship here, I scroll down to that activity feed. Um, I've got a very similar one here. Um, this one didn't leave uh, any notes, right? Um, and uh, while I'm here, I'll just quickly point out um, that it looks like a survey was taken at this same time. And uh, this was the response to a single survey uh, question. All right, hopefully that's helpful. And uh, that is how you can uh, report on field edge canvassing activity inside of your nation.